Hi, and welcome back to Trev's Travels by Narrowboats. If you're joining me today hoping to see a cruising video, I'm afraid there's not going to be one. I've got lots of cruising done and in the can, ready to go. The problem I've had since I've been on the Ashby Canal here, except for the very first evening, the internet has been very poor. The little five minute video I put up for Wednesday took nearly four hours to upload and that was after I compressed it. So until I get off the Ashby Canal again, I may not be able to upload any cruising videos. They're just too long. Anyway, that's enough of me rabbiting on. Let's get on with the video. It's a lovely little walk to the local farm shop. Well, I've just stopped at Stoke Golding. I'm going to take a little walk to the farm shop, see what they have to offer. Unusual moorings here. Little raised bits. With hardcore on. Very popular mooring spots. I was lucky to get the last mooring I pulled up. Right, bridge 25 here. Here we have the Ashby Boat Company, hire boat company. They have a small chandry there. And sell things like ice cream. There's a farm shop this way, I believe. Tomlinson's farm shop. Turn left just over the next bridge on right. This is interesting, look. Rope twist handrail. There must be an old rail line here or something. Look at that dog's barking over there. The old engine shed. Of course, quite locally to here, there's the Battlefield Steam Railway that runs when it can. And this must be the rail bridge, or was at one time. The old uh, telegraph post down there. The giveaway it was once a rail line. On the other side, once again. Definitely looks like an old disused railway line. Well, we haven't got much further to walk. I can see the sign already for the farm shop. Let's go on down there. If you come along the Ashby Canal, this is probably the fourth farm shop I've seen posted quite close to the canal. I was going to walk to one the other day near Bridge 6. It was the day when it kept snowing on and off, so I decided that wasn't for me. I don't mind the walk, I didn't really want to get covered in snow at the same time. So here we have it. Right, let's see what I've got to offer. That was nice. I got some vegetables. I also got myself a little treat. Minted lamb breast. I know I'm not supposed to eat red meat, but occasionally I do. I just hope Mr. Goat doesn't come back. I think I can get away with it. 
It's been a long time since I last ate red meat. Yes. I that brewery is not open today. Now I'm back to the canal. Just about to see my boat there in the distance. The last one in the line. Let's get back to the boat. Right, I'm back on the boat. It's clouded over somewhat. I was thinking about carrying on this afternoon and going a little further. The internet here is not very good. Do I carry on in that direction? Or do I stay here for the night? Hmm, I'd probably stay here for the night. Make a move in the morning. So what did I buy when I was in the farm shop? Well, I brought some lamb breast. A pork pie. Just three onions, I'm getting quite short at the moment. And to be quite honest with you, they were a little expensive in there. And I also got some new potatoes. These were locally grown. So the sign says, I can't wait to try them. And I think about a quarter of that is going to be my dinner for tonight with some pickle. As the sun's setting here over my right shoulder, I'd like to thank my Patreon and PayPal supporters. And of course, everybody that watches my vlog, video, whatever you want to call it. It just needs me to say, thank you very much for watching. Trevor out.